Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Strictly Fishing, and today I'm going to be showing you how to tie the arbor knot. And as you can see, I got some glasses. I needed them for long distance, and they will also be helping me with my fishing accuracy. So yeah, let's get started. So, what you're going to do here, you're going to take your line, my rope, put it under the spool, then over the spool, and then... You're going to cross this, this tag end, over this line, and then you're going to bring it under the big line. So it should look like that. And then what you do, you bring it through this loop, then you just made another loop right here, so you bring it through that loop. Then it should look like a pretzel, sort of pretzel knot. And you can cinch that down like that. Then you just make a basic knot. And you put it through that. So you have a basic knot up top there. And then what you do, you just pull your main line. And it's a little hard with the rope, but you just keep on pulling and it will cinch with the rope. With rope, it doesn't really cinch, so just pull on this right here, pull it all the way up, and then I pull the main line, and it is all the way cinched. It will be a lot smaller, like 30 times smaller with regular line. So that is the Arbor Knot. Hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and please subscribe. Thank you so much. Um, we are going up north this weekend, but like by my grandma and grandpa's house, it's a different part of the Wisconsin River. It's different. We're by a different part of the Wisconsin River. I'm not gonna be fishing the um, Wisconsin River. Um, it might rain, so the ice might be a little slushy. So we don't know if we're going to go ice fishing this weekend or not, but I hope we do. And it's Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas to everyone. Thank you for watching my video. I'll see you guys next time. Another video of Strictly Fishing. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.